Panther number two. This is um going to be a special chit chat. First, happy Native American Heritage Month. We're almost at the end, y'all. Because um, I haven't had a chance to look at any more comic characters. And it is now November 26th for another 10 minutes. So in that 10 minutes, we're going to step away from Native American heroes real quick. And we're going to go into some Power Ranger plot hole that I need someone who's a Power Ranger fan to answer. There are a lot of plot holes, alright? There's a lot of plot armor, but there's a lot of plot holes. And so, if you are a Power Ranger fan, like myself, because I don't have any of this knowledge, and I need this knowledge, because I don't know if uh, the Japanese version even had a Zordon. I don't remember. I know Dynaman didn't have a Zordon. They had a scientist. For those who do not know who Dynaman is, uh, Super Sentai Dynamo. Uh, Google it. Go watch it. Um, I would advise you that if you are um, under the age of like 14, you probably shouldn't watch it. Because if I remember correctly, there was a lot of upskirting for the Pink Ranger. I mean, every time you saw her, she really only wore skirts unless my memory is wrong. And somehow or another, back in the 80s, upskirting was a thing. So it's not nothing new, especially in Japan, for upskirting. For y'all who don't know, but anyway, if you know, you know. I need to know. This most important question. Who gave Zordon his powers? Was Zordon a ranger? Was Rita a ranger? And how in the astral hell did Zordon get to Earth? Secondly, how did he get stuck in the energy tube? And that's what this video is going to be. We are going to talk about these, these questions that I need ranger fans to answer. So this is not going to be a long video, but I'm asking a lot of questions. And I need you guys to help me find the answers because it's very important because no one's ever explained this shit. And also, side note, how old is Andros and them from KO35 and how does Zordon know them? Because if you remember, Andros killed Zordon. Excuse me, let me be politically correct. Zordon sacrificed himself and ordered Andros to unalive him. So, again, how does Andros know Zordon? And how come um, Zordon never mentioned Gose? How come Zordon never mentions Keeper? So, there are a lot of plot twists in the Power Rangers that just... I have not, not been answered. And I think I might take this to, to TikTok, too. But I need to know these answers to these questions. And, I mean, there's a lot more questions, but we're just going to stick with those for right now. Because the most important one... Or two is first off, how old is Andros and the people at KO35? And have they been Rangers longer than the Earth Rangers? And then again, how in the hell did Zordon and Rita's battle come to Earth? Where were they initially from? If Zordon was from Eltar, where the hell was Rita from? Secondly, how did Rita and Zed survive and become human? But Rita was her brother, he turned to dust. But yeah, you know, these are questions, and I need to know how these things happen. So if you have answers to that, please let me know, because um, I got to know. And I mean, I really got to know. Again, the most important question is, how did the battle between good and evil go from Eltar to KO-35 and Earth? Because somehow or another, Andros knows Zordon. But he doesn't know about Rangers of Earth. Go watch that, that, that last part of Power Rangers Turbo and that first part of Rangers in Space because he doesn't he doesn't act like he knows that there's more Ranger teams out there, but he, he does know Zordon. So how does this work? Anyway, that being said, thank you guys for watching. This is Kung Fu Africa number two. I'm Echo Fan Grey Wolf. Be seeing you.